thank you very much. No, no, no. The <clears throat> former deputy president uh, uh, came this morning <clears throat> uh, so that we could just meet because uh, something very good uh, for the country, uh, in particular for herself, that she has been appointed in one of the most important positions um, <clears throat> in the United Nations. When I heard the news, I, I, I quickly uh, congratulated her and also became very happy that uh, as a South African, uh, particularly coming from uh, our government as a former <clears throat> deputy president and <clears throat> an ANC cadre, that it was very, very, very pleasing that uh, she was given this honor uh, to be part of the UN important portfolio that deals with women. So I, I thought it was important that we congratulate her. And uh, <clears throat> certainly she also thought it was important to have this uh, uh, short meeting. And I, I'm, I'm very pleased that uh, we were able to meet this morning uh, to talk about it, uh, its importance, um, there are things that uh, we both agree are important in this portfolio that she's given. The contribution she could make, uh, some innovation she could make. So we, 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 we are very, 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 very happy as a country that our sister is going to be making a contribution at the global level. And then, of course, um, she qualifies uh, fully. It's not like... Uh, <clears throat> A token she qualifies. She has an experience of leading government. <clears throat> she comes from education sector. Uh, she has worked with uh, communities and people in the past, even long before she came to government. So I think uh, <clears throat> the, 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 the job will find a person who's ready to really make a contribution. I'm grateful for the opportunity to meet the president to get his encouragement and support on his behalf and on, on behalf of the people of South Africa. I am very grateful for the opportunity I had to serve the communities in South Africa, to serve the women in and out of government as part of the liberation movement, as part of the NGO sector, as well as an opportunity to work with the private sector. I think that has enabled me to learn, to fail sometimes, to be corrected and to get an insight on how to work with communities and with people. I'm hoping that this experience will enable me to serve the women of the world with all I have and uh, to ensure that uh, together with the other partners around the globe, we make the world a better place. But in particular, I will lean on the people of South Africa in my new job. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.